So, these are the streets of Montreal. It's so bright. It's really killing me, but I love it. I just run around the city and it's cold, but it's warm from Montreal. We have like, I don't know, maybe minus one or minus two degrees when there is wind. It's really harsh and I'm not wearing my scarf because of the audio, but yeah, it can get cold and it is cold, by the way. My fingers, I just have those gloves. They're like, ah, at some point, they're really, really cold, but well, you have to get your hands into a pouch and it's nice. I got my SIN, my social insurance number from Service Canada, very nice people there and talked a lot with the woman who served me and one thing that I haven't found in the internet, if you apply your SIN number, you should uh, have the, an address, just that they have something for reference. I had the address of my venue where I'm staying, but I didn't have the postal code, so, so the the um, woman from the Service Canada just found it out for me, but I mean, if you have the address, just make sure you have everything, just also, also the postal code, and then it's now really no problem to apply for the SIN number. It takes about, I don't know, 20 or 15 minutes waiting, and uh, 10 minutes talking to the people. So, very good service, I like it. Ah, it's just a lovely city. I like the buildings. I've been to the harbor, walked around at the harbor. There's so much ice. I mean, there is like, uh, when you see the river, it's getting very fast. There's no ice on this part, on everything else. There's quite a lot, quite a lot of ice on the water. And uh, I'll just show you around a little bit. In the hostel where I'm staying in the moment, they have the windows with the with the with the plastic foil covered, so to uh, make it clear just for the winter, so that there's I think it's because of moisture and to have a, another layer of insulation. So this is this is something I've never seen before, and you cannot open the windows. I think they have a some sort of different ventilation systems so that there is no <coughs> problems and well it's a beautiful day sunny and enjoyable just a perfect day to land I'm just enjoying this trip it's amazing To a few people that I was not able to say bye bye personally, I just want to say now thanks a lot for your support and uh, we had a great time and I hope when, we meet, when I'm back in Germany we'll meet. But uh, yeah, well, it's just not possible to meet everybody in the short amount of time I had. So, well, still to everybody else, I I think I made the right decision on the first day I'm just being here enjoying yeah definitely everything on point the people in the hostel are very lovely I yeah I like them so there are a lot of French people but I'm, I'm totally useless at French I have to practiced it a lot more. Everything everybody told me in French, I have no understand anything. But uh, yeah, well, can't have anything. And I went here for learning French, so why not? We're entering the harbor area. And what's really interesting is, if you if you at the if you have a if you are at the at a street in Canada, and you try to go over it, the people are always like 
like stopping for you. This is so crazy. In Germany, <laughs> nobody would stop at all. It's like very funny, but they're so polite, really. They are. So, for the first impressions, very nice. I love Montreal, really. I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay safe and see you soon. Bye bye.